What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Y'all seen the title, girl. We don't have to act like we don't know what we're about to talk about, and I don't have to tell y'all. But before we get into this video, I do want to say one thing. Regardless of uh, how I dress, all right, because these are clothes, regardless of how I dress, I am a woman, all right? I go by she and her, and I am for women, okay? And quite frankly, when women do dumb things, it makes me upset. But not only when they do dumb things, when they voluntarily do dumb things, it really, really grinds my gears, right? Now, for those that don't know, Blueface definitely had a phone call. He called in to us because he wanted to update us on his thoughts on Krishan being outside um, late or at her house, whatever. She wasn't checked in where he wanted her to check in at, okay? And with that being said, he came to tell us how he felt about that. Shall we? Hey, hey, hey. Yeah. All right. It's Blueface, baby. Y'all know I stay on the big neck like shoulders now. She knew what time it was before she came to work. Dead homies. But, 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 ain't no buts. It's my way or the highway. I let it bleed before I ever give leeway, and I give this the boot on her B day. It's that serious, and that's why. Look, check it out. If this fart, she's going up for adoption. <clears throat> Dead homies. You want to be with me? Better be on my tape. On this, ain't nothing open past old, but a hole. And I ain't harbor no hoes. Hear me, Bo? I hear you, Mo. So spread the word. Oh, that's why. Ain't nothing open but uh, a hose on a hoe. I don't know what he said in that last little situation with his um, nursery rhymes. What I do want to say is, in some relationships, you do have it to where, A, hey, don't come in after a certain time because please don't play with me like that. It's called respect. That is absolutely true. I'm with Carlissa when she's right. However, nigga, when you are in jail, I don't care what you're talking about. I'm sorry. Uh, you know, some of y'all, you know, stick by a nigga. And God knows, God forbid, we don't plan on this happening ever. But if I were to do some time... Of course, I would want my woman to be there, but am I about to hold you hostage to stay at home and I'm not even there? Bro, hell no. I think that that's selfish and I think that that's ridiculous and it sounds like, let me think, a man to me. So he wanted her to be on lockdown. This answered a lot of questions for a lot of us. He wanted her to be on lockdown because he didn't want her to have those legs open. That's exactly what he just said. We know that, right? He also has her taking care of his business financially, whether she say he asked or not, he didn't have to ask. I guarantee he insinuated it. Man, I'm about to be locked up. I ain't about to be working out. These nigga 13 million. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, 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 daddy, I'll pay. And then you got niggas like AB saying I need a dumb AB like this, not gonna lie. So for some women, you would have to ask, you like this? Like you, <clears throat> you like to be treated like this? And some women will tell you yes. Some women will tell you yes because A, they love him more than they love themselves. Or B, they don't care. They just want to do what he tell them to do just because that's just how some women are operated. Or C, that's my daddy, y'all. I'll, I'll do what he says. Right? Now, I haven't felt sorry for Krishan in a very long time because she tells you, I want to be treated this way, bro. She, she lets you know that. Okay? She lets you know. This is I need his help. He needs my help. Like, 
Yeah, both ways. Then why are you paying his bills? Because wow. that was offered. That wasn't. That wasn't. And, and me, it's not about money. It's not about money. It's really not. For you. Like, I had to learn the hard way. Um, Still learning the hard way. Um, we was beefing, and I was entitled of the money that I did make him, you know? And I felt some type of way when he was like, you're going to leave with nothing because that's the way I found you, blah, blah. I instantly went to say no more. Now I know how to move when I, okay, cool. What? This time in a relationship, I'm going to have my own money, my own account. And I'm still going to give it away. Stupid. She probably thought she said a whole mouthful with that one. Quite frankly, I want y'all to know that I don't get on here and um, what you call it, glorify celebrities and um, idolize. I don't idolize none of these. You know, that's something that a lot of people that are fans of people, they do that. <laughs> Not me. It's no idolizing here. No one to idolize. Okay. It's no one to... um you know, put on a pedestal at all. And nobody's asking to be, Krishan never asked to be put on a pedestal. She never asked to be the, the, uh, the representative of, um, the smartest woman in the world. She didn't ask for that and don't care either. <laughs> but I do know that I couldn't, it could never be me. Um, but quite frankly, I'm gonna just let y'all know this. She's a grown ass woman. She has made her decision and that's what she going to do. And ain't nobody going to stop her from it. She going to let you know. Because I don't give a f It's not about money. Right. So we pay rich nigga bills. No, you just pick up a roll and a trait when somebody actually needs you. Like, mm. I wouldn't want him paying nothing. I wouldn't want him touching nothing. I want him to just worry about his mind and his spirit while he's in jail. I'll take care of the bills. All you got to worry about is getting through your time with your head on your shoulders. You know you don't need to call Bobo or Wack to pay this guy off. I got you. I got it. Why? Because that's just my heart, nigga. That is me. Nobody's not going to change me for being me so with that being said do not come to my comments with all the accountability and you should tell her she should i ain't telling her krishana is a grown-ass woman and if she decides to be put on a leash um for this man to walk her like a dog then that's what she wants to do let her do it but i will continue to watch the circus unfold um so happy that this actually happened to be honest because the nigga had me fooled for a second i thought he was actually gonna be like you know what <laughs> this ain't the life i want to live i don't ever want to be in here no more i hope he you know change a lot of other things hopefully but if not whatever um but ultimately um this is what he has decided this is what she has decided and i've decided to continue to watch and let them do them. All right. So please spare me with the you should and be on her side. I don't care. I wish it wasn't like this. I wish she wouldn't be so stupid. But she is. And that's what she has chosen to be. And if she was my friend, I'd tell her the same. And if we would have had to fight, girl, we would have threw them hands. Because this is just hypocrisy to me. You know what I'm saying? But that's what she want to do. So, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I am done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Uh-huh.